This is Craig Mertens, Director of Product Education for Inktavo, the parent company of Inksoft. We've completely redesigned the edit product experience for blank and custom pre-decorated products. We've made the process faster, easier, and a whole lot more intuitive. Let's jump in. This update is all about streamlining your workflow so you can spend less time configuring your products and more time growing your business. You'll notice right away the interface feels familiar because we've modeled it after the Rapid Product Creator, but we've also made it more flexible, more powerful, and way more efficient. Whether you're onboarding new staff, updating pricing, adding new products to a store, or just cleaning things up, you're going to notice a big difference here. When you land on the Edit Product screen, you'll start in the General tab. This is where you control all the basics, product status, store assignments, categories, everything that sets the foundation of a product. You can manage the product name, default color, main image, supplier, manufacturer, and SKU details. We've even added an easy-to-copy Inksoft product ID, which is super handy for anyone using the API. The product description now supports rich formatting thanks to the new What You See Is What You Get editor, so you can add bold text, add links, or customize a layout without needing HTML. Below that, you'll see a new size management tool. You can assign an existing size chart or upload a custom chart just for this product. You can even label it whatever you want. Then at the bottom, you can manage available sizes, turn them on or off, assign them to specific colors, update weights, or add new ones from scratch. It's clean, flexible, and built to save you time. Next up is the Decoration tab, which replaces what used to be called Print Regions. Here you'll manage print regions, decoration methods, and how the product is purchased. You can add regions by naming them, setting dimensions, and placing them directly on the canvas. Required fields are highlighted so you know exactly what's missing, and once it's filled out, you can fine-tune the print region using the pencil tool. You can toggle between sides, delete regions, and even manage regions for the back, sleeves, or other sides as long as you've uploaded an image for them. We also support available print widths and designer overlays. A designer overlay is a mask that enables you to set up unique print regions for products that support edge-to-edge -edge printing or irregular print areas. If a side is active and has a print region, you can upload a custom overlay. A link to an instruction guide is located right in the interface. Decoration settings are tuned to your account, so you'll only see options like screen print, embroidery, or digital print if they're enabled on your account. You can turn a decoration method on or off for a product, assign a pricing grid, or add custom settings. If you offer free printing, just toggle it on and we'll remove pricing grid assignments. You can also set custom ink palettes or max print color limits. And down at the bottom, you'll choose how the product can be purchased. Blank, customized in the design studio, or quoted with a customer upload. The whole section is consolidated, so it's easy to manage all of these options in one view, globally or per store. Moving on to the Colors and Image tab, this is where you'll manage product colors, swatches, and images. You can upload custom photos, set availability by store, assign pricing grids, set minimums, and flag whether a product or color is active. This section is straightforward but powerful. It gives you precise control over how your products show up in your storefront. Next is the Pricing and Inventory tab. This is where you'll choose between fixed pricing or a pricing rule and decide whether to manage inventory from your own stock or from a connected supplier. You can enable quantity discounts, mark products as on sale, and control overall availability. If you're managing pricing per store, the Style Pricing and Inventory section lets you override prices just for that store. And you can also apply bulk actions too, like setting everything on sale at once. The inventory section changes based on your setup. If you're using your own inventory, you can enter quantities directly. If you're synced to a supplier, we'll show their inventory numbers automatically. The advanced tab is where you'll handle more technical settings. Minimums, SEO, tax settings, Google product feed settings, GTIN or UPC values. And if the product is pre-decorated, you'll also have an option for processing time. If your product has been designated as pre-decorated, you'll have an additional tab, Personalization. This is where you can add custom personalization fields. For instance, you want to collect the name and number for uniforms. We've also refined and modernized the view and store option. So if a product is assigned to any store, you can click through and preview exactly how it will appear live in the store. So what do these improvements mean for you? You can update product info faster with fewer clicks and less confusion. It's easier to build and manage stores, especially if you're adding custom or pre-decorated products. And if you're just getting started with Inksoft, the new interface makes onboarding a breeze. The entire flow is more organized, more intuitive, and built for busy shops that want to move fast without sacrificing quality. This is a big step forward in how you manage products with Inksoft, and we're excited for you to give it a try. If you've got questions or want help exploring the new features, reach out to the Inksoft success team. We're here to support you. Mm -hmm.